Okay, so you've got your clients and you're ready to go. You've got your Zoom link. So you're going over to your Zoom and we're going to grab our link. Go to my account. Look at your meetings. Now, you don't want to have to keep opening Zoom every time you want to get involved with the child. So let's say I want to be able to just open a calendar. What you do is you go into your Zoom, you copy that link, then you go to your Google Calendar. Let's say this is for Sue, and you want to see how do you want this. I want to make it a repeating one, and I'll have her do this weekly on Sundays. Let's say she's going to be twice a week. You hit custom and you can say Sunday <clears throat> and Saturday. When is the end date? Never until she cancels. And we're going to add the location. And you do control V and save. This means that every time you meet her, you both will meet in this event. So Anytime you need to go to her class, you just click calendar, like let's say you're busy with other students, all you have to do is click on your calendar. And if you click on your calendar, I just click and all my students have their own special links that I just click to get to. So all I have to do is just click. So this is how you add your links into your Google Calendar and you just press and save so that anytime you're stuck, you're in between classes, all you, if you're in Google, you just hit calendar, boom, your whole calendar's in front of you. And then you'll be able to get to all your classes quickly. So this is how we use Google calendars.